with intermediary nailing techniques uh, after the nail is inserted and proximal locking has been carried out in this position, uh, distal locking will be facilitated by changing the leg position. So first we'll elevate the leg. We'll drop the proximal femoral side down to the uh, number four uh, and number four holes. Then we'll move the foot attachment back up to the neutral position. And then also use the 4-4 four, four hole pattern for the distal goal posts. Apply our leg pad. And now the leg is in a position that's parallel to the floor so it makes it easier to do AP and lateral visualization uh, of the distal tibia locking sites uh, with the C-arm. 